everyone, I'm Emily and this is Fran. And for this episode, we decided to change it slightly and discuss our top five tips when talking about obesity with patients. We created these top tips with the Beyond the Scales team to help facilitate these conversations. So our first tip for starting these conversations is stating why you're having this discussion. It should be directly related to a health condition or be related to improving health. Yes, it's very important for a patient to understand why the conversation is happening, but also from the patient's perspective, if they don't understand why weight management is needed, they're less likely to make changes and be on board with any recommendations. So this nicely leads into our second tip of being clear from the start that you are not judging the patient. Yes, and I think during uh, filming for this podcast, we've heard how patients can often feel judged by healthcare professionals, Mm -hmm. and this can have a drastic effect on their relationship with other healthcare professionals. This can affect them coming forward for support with any health conditions, and the atmosphere of any future consultations could be more tense. It can also help to highlight that you understand obesity is a chronic disease and it's not the patient's fault. Yeah, showing this empathy could help patients feel more comfortable discussing their medical problems and open up a lot more. If you're personally concerned about your own biases and assumptions, we recommend that you complete the questionnaire as recommended by Dr. Faye Mills in our previous episode that is um, available from King's College that helps highlight to you your personal biases and assumptions. Our third top tip is making sure you have this discussion in an appropriate environment. So making sure you have the correct chairs, couches and beds is important to make the patient feel comfortable. It's also important to make sure that the patients have easy access to the consultation rooms and parking. Now we both know that this can be particularly challenging however trying your best particularly for um, elective appointments and ensuring there is easy access around the room as well can really help with patient rapport. Our next tip is to explain how their medical condition could be improved by tackling obesity. This could be highlighting how obesity is a complex condition with different health problems linked to this and why treating their obesity will help them personally. Our final tip is to offer them the correct help and support. Making sure to check what specialist help is available in your local area, as this does vary across the UK, and what referral criteria there is and how to make the referral is very important. If appropriate, patients could also be referred to a weight management programme to get support for their obesity journey. Thank you for listening, everyone. We hope you find these tips helpful. Bye. Bye.